Gaoxiong Mayor Han Guoyu's recall election is just two weeks away, and the latest polling doesn't bode well for the mayor. In a new survey conducted by INA News, nearly 46% of respondents said they intend to vote on June 6th. And among the respondents who intend to vote, 92% plan to vote yes to a recall. The survey joins a large body of polling that shows the mayor likely to be removed. For the recall motion to pass, at least 25% of eligible voters will need to vote in favour, and yes votes must exceed the number of votes for no. Pro-recall activists held an event on Sunday outside Kaohsiung's Qishan railway station. According to a recent poll by INA News, around 57% of Kaohsiung residents favor a recall, versus 30% who oppose it. Over 45% of Kaohsiung residents said they intended to use their ballot. About 92% of those respondents say they would vote yes to a recall. It's a tug of war between the pro recall and anti recall camps. It's a closely fought contest, so don't go thinking that the vote on June 6 will inevitably lead to a recall. We've still got work to do. Recalling Han Guoyu is a small matter, but what you're recalling is an entire policy direction for Kaohsiung's economic transformation. I think that's something the people of Kaohsiung should seriously think about. The KMT is rallying a show of support. Meanwhile, Han's camp has called on his supporters to forego their ballot and to monitor other voters in a move that could suppress turnout. In the INA News poll, nearly 65% of respondents say they disapproved of the KMT's strategy. Nearly 40% of respondents said they believe the strategy could affect voter turnout. In a different poll conducted by the New Power Party, some 60% of respondents said they intended to vote. That's six percentage points lower than those willing to cast a vote in April. In order for the recall to pass, at least 25% of eligible voters in Kaohsiung must vote in favor.